Brazilian beats and African rhythms. It's a musical collision of cultures called world music. And the person behind it is a girl from Ipanema. Cecil Paz is in our studios and Washington Full Circle starts right now. Welcome to Washington Full Circle, I'm Fermat Patterson. From Rio, the cultural heart of Brazil, to the melting pot of DC's Adams Morgan, vocalist Cesar Paz is spreading the musical sounds of her own special blend of Brazilian fusion. For today's show, we're gonna call it The House Mix. Thanks so much for stopping by. Thank you for having me. And filling our house with music. Yes, please. <laughs> <laughs> now tell me exactly, uh, in your own words, what's Brazilian fusion? So the reason I called it that is because I decided that I wanted to, mo to, ch to, to mix the music with the music of Lusophone Africa. Mm -hmm. So Brazilian music is already very African. We have a lot of influence from Nigeria and Congo and different places in Africa. But the music from the Lusophone diaspora, meaning the people who speak Portuguese in, um, in, in Africa, mm -hmm is so similar to our music and I'm not, I'm not sure if it's because of the language or what it is or be because some of the tribal, you know, I need to, I guess I need to study, study a little more about that, but it's very, um, very similar and it, it resonates really well with us also because of the language, mm -hmm. which they speak Creole or Portuguese Creole. So it's, it just made a lot of sense to me, but that's what I've been using to mix, to mix the sounds and kind of make it my own. And I, I think that's what's interesting about the album is that it's, it's something different, something fresh, something that not many people are doing. That's right. You've or been, not from this approach anyway. You've been spending time on this new album and, and this is it. Um, this is what you've been working on, your blend of Brazilian and other music. Uh, tell us, where was this produced? It was done in Brazil, in Rio by the producer's name is J.P. Silva. He, he used to be the musical director for Elza Soares, who's a very famous Brazilian singer from, I guess she started in the, the 50s, I guess. She's, she's been around for a long time, mm -hmm. and she's wonderful. And they've been working together for a while, and he, we met and, and we were talking about the music of Cape Verde and the music of Angola and, and the Afro-Brazilian music itself, and mm -hmm. we, have, we had this, this passion in common. And he was like, let's do it, let's do this. <laughs> so we made it happen four years later. <laughs> mm -hmm. And I understand you did something uh, uh not so unusual today, but uh, you had some fundraising done on the web to finish this album. Tell us yes. about that. Yes, so I did a Kickstarter campaign when I uh. first started uh, planning for this project. It was a struggle, it was really <laughs> hard work. <laughs> but I'm so thankful and I'm so happy that I did it because it ended up doing really well. I got all the money that I asked for and I got amazing support even though I was just beginning. I was, I was actually kind of surprised that I, I was able to, to get what I needed. It wasn't enough to complete the whole album, but it was definitely what I asked for in the, in the Kickstarter campaign and I got it. And I was really, really grateful to all the contributors. Thank uh. you so much, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> now, as a young girl from Ipanema, uh, tell us wh what was your first influence that made you say, oh, I want to start singing, I want to start producing music. When did you discover that? Well, I started singing and playing guitar when I was like 10 years old. My dad brought me my first guitar and I started playing <laughs> around with it. And I would just for fun, you know, we'd go to the beach and play guitar and hang out and until like 8 o'clock at night in Rio. And it became, it's a big part of my culture. So music is huge. Music and dance is a huge part of, of Brazilian culture. Mm -hmm. And people are so, you know, and that's, that's the Brazilian spirit that everybody loves. People are just always happy and always trying to have fun and trying to have, engage each other. And music is, is a great way to do that. So it became a huge part of my life and progressively it became more and more and more and more important to the mm -hmm. point where I said, you know, this is what I want to do. Like, for real, for real, this is what I want to do. And now you're doing it all over Washington. Yeah. Why did you choose Washington? Well, my parents moved here when, when was it? It was like a long time ago, 1994. Mm -hmm. And so I came, I came to live with them and 
it kind of grew on me. In the beginning, I, I must admit, I did not like it coming not from like Rio. Washington. Well, I love it now. <laughs> but in the beginning, you know, coming from Rio de Janeiro to, oh, well. to I actually moved to Virginia, it was like, what am I doing here? It's so <laughs> cold. The people are strange. I don't understand. I spoke English pretty well, but I was still kind of struggling with, with slang and things like that. Mm -hmm. So it was a struggle to adapt, but, but now I'm... No, I'm happy. It. No, Loving I love it, it. Right? Yes. I love DC, yeah. Now, where, people who love your music, where, where can they hear you in the city besides listening to your CD? Right, so I, I do all kinds of different festivals and different shows, but my only show that's, that's kind of consistent is at Bossa Bistro in Adams Morgan mm -hmm. every last Thursday of the month. The next one's going to be New Year's Eve, and we're doing a dress in white party, which is uh, custom, customary in Brazil to dress in white to mm -hmm. bring in peace to the new year, which is so needed right now with all the horrible things happening in yes. the world. So yes. I think it's a good opportunity for us to try to bring in that energy to the new, the new year. Yeah. So no. it's it's at uh, in Adams Morgan. It's called Bossa Bistro. We start at ten. Ah, I know Adams. I'm a Adams Morgan uh, resident. So oh, I'm okay. Well. You're a neighbor, so you got to come. Yeah, I definitely mm -hmm. will. Now people mostly think of Brazil. They think of the Bossa Nova, but there's so much more. Oh, yeah. um, we'll talk about that a little later. But there's going to be lots of music. Yes. Don't go away. We will be right back with the sounds of Brazilian fusion with vocalist Cesar Paz performing right here in our studio. Welcome back to Washington Full Circle and our special guest, Brazilian vocalist Cesar Paz. Thank you so much for giving us a little music today and the music that's on here. Where can people get this? Um, it's pretty much all over. They can get it at Amazon, uh, iTunes, it's in Spotify, or the best way to get it is to go into my website, www.cesapaz.com, and they can get it right there. Okay. CD Baby, too. <laughs> it's all over. <laughs> now, I'm just looking at some of the selections on here. What inspired uh, these particular songs? Was there anything special? Yeah, you know, picking songs is one of the hardest things. I'm sure. There, some of these songs are original compositions. Uh, some of them are, are covers that, I, that we reimagined <laughs> <laughs> and did it, kind of made it our own style. Like mm -hmm. I said, I wanted to mix the African with the Brazilian rhythms and use a lot of the Lusophone influences. Mm -hmm. So that's, that's kind of what I was looking for, but I was looking for pieces that, that not, they make you move a little bit, but they're also very melodic. So, you know soft but happy and dancey at the same time. I think you like dancing, don't you? I do. <laughs> I love when people da are dancing in my shows. It makes me happy. Now, where do you go to dance in D.C. if you feel like really cutting loose? You know, lately, I wish I had more time to go dancing because I love it, but there's so many different places to go. Uh, actually, he's, he's the guy to ask for oh, like okay. house music and stuff. I just haven't been going out dancing that much, but for Brazilian, of course, you can always look at my website. There's, there's different shows and um, there's some meetup groups that you can join that yeah. has, uh, that have different shows in the, in the neighborhood. Okay. So, but anywhere pretty much, like it could be at the Hamilton, it could be at Bossa, it could be at Tropicalia. Those are some places that are, that are really good for dancing. But you're gonna do a little dancing and singing right now. Sure, I do a little dancing. All right, <laughs> I'll let you have it. Hit it. Thank you. Here, take this for me. <laughs> Thank you. Sininha, cotinha, cobra que te molde a cascavé A cobra que não morde o desalinha Sininha, cotinha, cobra que te molde a cascavé Aqui no molde dá um nó cego Daqueles que quinda é só minha com mate fulô Não morde dá um nó cego Daqueles que quinda é só minha com mate A cobra que não morde o desalinha Sininha, cotinha, cobra que te molde a cascavé A cobra que não morde o desalinha Sininha, cotinha, cobra que te molde a cascavé 
A que não morde dá um nó cego Daqueles que quinda é só minha Com mate pulou Não morde dá um nó cego Daqueles que quinda é só minha Com mate A cobra que não morde diz a linha Se minha cotinha cobra que te morde a cascavel A cobra que não morde diz a linha Se minha cotinha cobra que te morde a cascavel a que não morde dá um nó cego Daqueles que quinda é só minha Com mate pulou Não morde dá um nó cego Daqueles que quinda é só minha Com mate embora e rola no chão Sangue e peixeira na mão Luta escorrega, solta a luta A poeira cobre o chão Sangue e peixeira na mão Escorrega, solta a luta A poeira cobre o chão Sangue e peixeira na mão A cobra que não morde diz a linha Sininha com a tinha cobra que te morde a cascavel a cobra que não morde diz a linha Sininha com a tinha cobra que te morde a cascavel A que não morde dá um nó cego Daqueles que quinda é só minha com mate fulô Não morde dá um nó cego Daqueles que quinda é só minha com mate A cobra que não morde diz a linha Sininha com a tinha cobra que te morde a cascavel A cobra que não morde diz a linha Sininha com a tinha cobra que te morde a cascavel A que não morde dá um nó cego Daqueles que quinda é só minha com mate pulou Não morde, dá um nó cego Daqueles que quinda é só minha com mate Embole e rola no chão Sangue e peixeira na mão Luta, escorrega, solta, luta A poeira cobre o chão Sangue e peixeira na mão Luta, escorrega, solta Luta, a poeira cobre o chão, sangue e peixeira na Thank you guys. And welcome back to Washington Full Circle. Now before we go, here's a little bit more about this particular CD. But we've been hearing all of these guys playing, but we haven't been introduced to them. Can you tell us who you're with today? Sure, definitely. So on saxophone, I have Michelle Nirenberg, who also has a really nice CD that came out recently. Ah, nice to see. Brazilian jazz. And then John Lee on guitar. He can play any kind of guitar you want. <laughs> Pablo Oliveira, Pablo do Cavaco, sometimes we call him. <laughs> my, my faithful, I've been playing with this guy for years. Lucas Ashby is on drums. And Ethan Foote on on bass hey. working it out for us <laughs> and on back vocals and percussion is jean francis va terrific you guys are doing a great job but we're anxious to hear more Let's of cesar paz <laughs> so take us away thank you thank you this next one's called saluba Crente me recrias ao abrir o ori Pra entrar o orixá que diz te quero Quero, quero, oh, quero, quero E a saluba E 
Tu tantas vezes mãe, nós duas vezes filho Nos faz florescer da lama Na natureza viva que diz Quero, quero, oh, oh, quero, quero E a saluba E a saluba E a saluba Não tem medo de cair Eu cresci ouvindo os discos de Caetano e de Gilberto Gil Você me deu amor Mas não era a metade do que eu te dei Sim, confesso que errei Mas teu erro é bem maior que o meu mas o mundo gira Ele vai girar Mas o mundo gira Ele vai girar Você tá aí sozinha E eu sozinho penso assim Dance, menina Porque é o que restou de você Você me deu amor Mas não era a metade do que eu te dei Sim, confesso que errei Mas teu erro é bem maior que o meu mas o mundo gira Ele vai girar Mas o mundo gira Eu falei que ia girar
Thank you. Thank you so much for having us.